so far we've looked at a couple examples of throwing the snag route. We've even looked at a example of throwing a tagged backside uh, bench route. But what we haven't looked at is the first option on the triangle uh, snag play, snag concept that uh, Phil Longo runs as part of his air raid attack. We're going to go ahead and look at that here and see what kind of look you're going to expect this against. Now here you've got the snag. Again, you know it's the snag side because it's the side with the back. You've got the three threats here. Now they're a little bit closer to the boundary here. So the defense has aligned with three over two on the field side. So now you are going to work the snag side. You're going to work the triangle side because it's just two over two. But you've got a hard corner this time and a cover two safety. So that for the quarterback in pre-snap is going to suggest right here, you're going to get that corner route. So as soon as he, as soon as he drops, he's going to take a look to see if this corner bails. If the corner stays hard, he knows right now where he's going. And so now it's just settle your feet and make this throw on time. And again, for the receiver, the idea here is you're going to plant at about 10 yards and just roll this out. They don't want to roll. They don't want this to be run real high there. This is almost like an out really more than a corner because the idea is if this safety is going to have to play honest and prevent say a shake route where he's going to plant here and come inside. If he gets real nosy to the outside, you're just going to shake him. You're going to tag this and have him go to the post. And then that's going to be a touchdown. So if he's going to do that and play honest, it's going to be really hard to get underneath this. If it's thrown flat and you want to throw this just down to flatten the receiver out away from the, from the safety five yards from the, from the, uh, from the boundary. This is good timing, excellent location there aren't many safeties that are going to be able to get under that and break that up. So if you see this hard corner, that's where you're going to see that ball going on this concept. Now, one other thing to note, when when this corner is, is pursuing like this, you're going to end up seeing some rub action as well where the, uh, the, the swing route becomes a good option as well. Although here, because the corner is not, uh, is not dropping, this first option is open. So you're just going to take that and... Again, this is this is easy. This is seven on seven stuff. As long as you're you're not giving a free run to your quarterback, and even there, you're getting this off so quickly that this is very difficult for a defense to stop.